Hi, this is a tutorial for using your CryCut design space to make custom paint masks for outline numbers on models. In this instance, a 1 16th scale King Tiger, but these can be rescaled as appropriate. So, the first step is you go across to text and you type in your number. So, in this instance, 332 will be the example we use. Uh, and for my King Tiger, I use the Bain Scrifts font, uh, which I find is closest to the photos that I've seen. All right, so you click into your workspace, reselect the thing, drag it up the center for ease. Okay, so first thing we're going to do is we're going to make a duplicate, and then we want to change the color of that duplicate. In this instance, I use gray. Right, we select the duplicate. Now that we change the color, and we make another seven of these, all right? And this is so we can create a full outline. Because we want eight in total. Okay, now that we've got our eight, so we go back and we select our original one, and we right click, and we want to move that to the front. And then we want to select all, so hit Control A, and then we go up to a line, and we go down and select center. This will bring them all together. All right. Now we go back up, and we select the first of our duplicates. Now, I find the easiest way is to use the up, down, and side arrows on your keypad, all right, or keyboard, and we select the first one, and we go up, select the next one, go right, Next one down, and the fourth one left. Now you can see this doesn't create a complete outline, and this is why we have the eight. Let's select our fifth one, up and left, up and right, down and right, and down and left. Okay, now. Scroll back up, select your first one, and drag it out of the way. Okay, now we select all our duplicates together, and then we hit Weld, and this will make it a single image. Okay, now that that's done, we select both of those, go up to a line, center, go back to our original, right click, send to front. And there we have the outline. Now, you can't just make it from this image because what it'll do is it'll do two separate cuts. So in order to create one single cut, what we do is we select all of them. So select both images and we go down and we select slice. And so we'll create a third image. Right. Now, what we do now is we go back to the original and we delete the original. We delete the welded one. And what we're left with is the outline. So what you can do now is you can hit make it and it will do a single cut in a single spot. And you now, because this is a single image, you can duplicate it, you can resize it depending on what your scale is or if you've got different size numbers. So on a King Tiger, you've got two sort of two centimeter size numbers on each side of the turret and then on the back of the turret usually is about a 1.5 centimeter one so you can you create one 1.5 centimeters the best way to do that is you select duplicate and then the uh, you can rescale it down to 1.5 centimeters All right, and then that gives you a smaller one Okay, I hope this helps for those who've got uh, the CryCut design space and want to create outline numbers uh, for whatever purpose, um, but RC tanks in particular. Uh, and thanks very much for watching.